Welcome to Short View Trading. This is your morning market hit for Thursday, 11th of March. What matters today for traders? Well, price action in markets was encouraging for the bulls yesterday, especially in the NASDAQ 100, which rallied higher, closing above its key technical resistance level at 12,750. And it pushed above its 38.2% Fibonacci retracement level. That's the retracement of the losses since the 16th of Feb highs. It's technically an important threshold. If we look at the S&P 500, a more balanced index with more cyclical stocks, it's therefore been more impressive in the rally, moving above its 76.4% Fibonacci retracement level and now close to testing its late Feb highs. So the equity market rally is looking pretty resilient, particularly in those two key tech-centric indices. And especially given that in reality, bond yields haven't really come off their highs that much. The closing high on Monday was 1.59%. Yesterday's close was 153. It's only down six bips in the past two days. So tech is weathering a storm of higher yields pretty well. Cyclicals, of course, are thriving with higher yields with new highs overall in the cyclical sectors of the S&P 500. And then over in Europe, a new record high in the DAX, which is in breakout mode. So upside momentum is building and in the past few days the dollar index has been weaker. You can see that on this chart where the scale for the dollar is inverted. Usually a weaker dollar is associated with equity market strength. And that's what's interesting about our models. They've been flagging up sell signals for the dollar in recent trading days as this chart shows. So the US dollar is overbought. We're expecting weakness. That's one of the reasons why we've been recommending long positions in US equities in our daily trading publication, which is available on our website to subscribers. We also offer a free trial. And in that publication, we make a one to two week trading recommendation driven really by the messaging we're getting from our short term trading models like this one that you can see on your screen now. This measures risk appetite across global markets and it's recently generated a buy signal for equities. So what are we doing today? Are we running with the long position or not? Have a look at the daily trading publication on the website. What are we watching today? Well, in terms of data out of the US, we've got Jolt's job openings in Europe. It's the ECB policy decision at 12.45, followed by a press conference with Lagarde at 1.30. That was your morning market hit. Do follow us on YouTube, search under Shortview Trading. Join us on Twitter, LinkedIn and or Facebook. Thanks for listening.